This is my hostel room where I've been staying from the last two years. It has gotten super messy and chaotic. So it's time for a room transformation. I'm going to be deep cleaning this room, organizing everything, and also giving you some very useful tips. Giving you all a budget-friendly haul, and also trying out some Pinterest-inspired room decor. Room makeover in 24 hours. What's up, guys? Welcome to my channel. I'm Advika. I have done a lot of room tours slash room makeover, but I think there are pretty many videos like that on my channel. My style has changed a lot in these two years. I really want to transform this room, which is, by the way, a government hostel dorm room, and I want to do a makeover, but in a dorm-friendly style. Obviously, there are so many things to do, but the first thing has to be cleaning it. Okay, the bed is done, but that's like not even 10% of the room, I guess. The room is still pretty messy, but at least I'm gonna have a clean space to sleep today. a sitting area as well as i can use it for my storage i'll show you what i'm talking about let me unbox this i got this for some extra storage because i really struggle with storage in my room and i thought ki at least for all the dishes i'm going to have another storage unit and i'm going to use this to store all the utensils because right now they literally just lie anywhere around mostly on my desk and i am done with looking at them there so i want them to have a perfect place to go to okay, so this is the box inside This is pretty hard, so like I can literally sit on this. This could like literally act as a chair. I'm not even kidding. Yes, I changed into comfy clothes. The room is clean. There is still a lot of organization left. Took a decent amount of time. Once my exams get over now, I'm gonna get to the organizing and makeover part and basically transitioning this whole space. And I'm so excited and stoked for that. Hi guys, so I am back today. I am going to be unboxing all these parcels. The past week, I received so many Amazon parcels, so damn many. These are all of them. And today, I'm gonna be unboxing it all together. Let's just start randomly. I ordered a satin pillowcase. They also sent me some scrunchies. I did not expect this from an Amazon order. Tulip. <gasps> okay, the quality is not that bad, honestly. But these are just less than I thought they would be. What is this? Let's see. Got this to organize the fridge. So it's a container to keep all the fruits. What is this? They're so small. Are you kidding me? These are like money plants. So small. This it's not supportable. But also, like, what did I expect? I paid around one fifty rupees for these two. Okay, this is something I'm excited about. This is a globe. So it changes the color like this. Perfect for my mood swings. Like. Pretty, but it's like very small. I ordered this for the tulips. So let's see. Um. <laughs> no, it does not look good. I ordered some hangers. They're like four things, so I am hoping that this turns out better for my storage issue. This I got for storage in again my wardrobe because wardrobe ki situation bahut messy hai. So this might help me. I was most excited for this. Yay! Iska use kya hai ye to jab main karungi tabhi I'll show you all. I have a good feeling about this, guys. It's one of those aesthetic lamps that we see all over Pinterest. Cushion. This one's so pretty. It's giving all the boho vibe. Not bad, right? This is gonna be an interesting one. Let's open it up. It's a box for storage, but it's a wooden. Is box ke andar hai ek aur boxa, and then we have another one. So we have three total boxes. This one's the last one. Let's open it up. 
So this is a crate again for clothes and to arrange them. You can see yes, right now this is all that I ordered and all that I received. But anyways, we'll see you guys in the room makeover now. Hello, it's another day. It's actually just the next day. It's currently 6 p.m. of 17th January and I'm about to be starting the whole makeover part that I've been waiting from so long. The fridge is just next to my bed so I don't just use it as a fridge but also as my side table. I'm gonna start with the top. Okay, let's get going. everything from the top of the fridge this is how dirty it looks a lot of dust and i don't know what all stuff is here to our rescue i have a mini handheld vacuum cleaner <laughs> I also have some cleaning supplies like this tablecloth. It's a microfiber cloth. And then I also have Collins. So I'm going to be cleaning this up as much as I can. Now it is pretty much... Today it is time to clean another segment of my room which is this shelf. One of my biggest purchase regrets has to be this shelf because I wanted something very aesthetic but then I forgot about the term called storage. Since I have a lot of things in my room and the room is not that big, I do struggle a lot with storage and so my concern should have been getting something for the storage. But leaving me, I got something for the aesthetic. Now I'm struggling with it. Neither does this look aesthetic anymore. Neither does it help me with storage. It's time to fix that. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so first First, I'm gonna clear out everything from the shelf and then move the shelf clean behind and then start decorating it. So let's start. Guys, what the hell is this? I think it was better when I did not see what's behind this. After looking at it, all it gave me is trauma. I don't know what the hell to do now. I really don't wanna. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Why did I see that? Over okay, so after crying and all, I finally cleaned the area behind the shelf. The shelf is still dirty, but I still kind of cleaned it with the haru. It's time to clean this properly. Let's go. Over se to jaldi dusty mein nikal diye, but still pretty dirty. So. Okay, so now the shelf is clean. I think this is gonna be the easiest part, which is just to keep stuff on it. However, I just have so much stuff and just looking at it is kind of making me scary and I have no idea how I want to decorate it. I think I'm gonna use the bottommost part for keeping the books and all. Um, And I also got this kind of a storage box for my storage. So I might also be using these. <gasps> Anyways, so yeah, so I'm gonna be using this. Let's see if it really works. So the room makeover has been quite delayed. I expected it to be finished like within a week, but it has been many weeks. We are still not even close to done. So I've decided to challenge myself to do a whole room makeover in 24 hours. I'm gonna be committed to this one and finish it ASAP. First up, I'm gonna clean this whole wardrobe. This is the part that I have been most scared about and I was like, I'm just gonna delay it, delay it. But now it's finally the day, face my fear and clean this thing out. Okay, by the way, 
way, I got a new phone case, a new phone cover, and it's so pretty. You know, what do you think about it? So this is my wardrobe. The main issue, if you can't already see, there's just too much stuff and very less storage. So that's why I'm gonna try my best to do whatever I can with this storage. I got the kind of organizers. These are mainly for the top section. However, I don't know if it's gonna fit there. Let's try. It does not fit. If you're also thinking of organizing your wardrobe and you struggle with space, then my organization tip, which I also saw online, is that use the vertical space as much as you can. For example, right now my clothes were just lying around like this. However, this upper ka pura area is left. So I'm gonna use these storage boxes because this goes up till there, so I'm gonna be using the vertical space if that makes any sense. So for the uppermost area, I usually keep like some fancy clothes and my bed sheets. Let's start. I'm trying to get you on my mind less but then again i couldn't mind less got me like what's in your coffee i hope you call me and we can talk about our hobbies yeah like finding movies to get lost in Including freezes from the office. Okay, so the upper shelf is done now. I'm gonna go with the biggest mess, which is the middle section. It's the most scariest one, so wish me luck, please. Probably not too healthy. You got me over here obsessing. Whoa. Friends call me stupid, call me crazy. Well, so long to send it This is all the mess this whole pile of clothes this seems cleaner than ever i'm gonna be organizing it i don't know how much would be successful but let's go baby like master card your price this steady yeah you got no limit so girl let's spend it a couple weeks in costa rica where we both can kick it i give you my sovereignty we play monopoly you won the boardwalk but you're living in my head rent free I got two crates which I showed you guys in the haul. I am gonna be using them to keep my night suits, joggers, rack pants, basically gym wear and all that stuff. Okay, I am excited for this. This is how it is supposed to build, like one over the other. Let's get to work. So these two sections are done. And then now I am onto this section. Basically, it has my inners, my bathrobe and a couple of extra. Done. Finally looks better now. Okay, and now it's time for the big announcement. This wall behind me, the wall that we all love, the wall which is probably the most iconic thing in this whole room, it is going. I really want the wall to be, I look at I'm like, wow, this girl seems like she has her life together. Right now, it does not seem like. I'm a little skeptical that if I take out all the posters, then they mark marks. I'm not gonna paint all over again right now. So I don't know what I'm gonna do about that. But right now, let's stop talking and let's get to work. I'm not gonna lie, but this just does not even look like my room. I don't know if it's that visible on camera, but yeah. It's only gonna get better from here. Like, what worse could happen to this wall, right? <laughs> this is so weird. Like, usually when I'm in this position, I have all colorful things behind me. But anyway, I ordered some frames from Amazon and I am about to open them. Look at this one's cute. Like, these are little A3 ones. This one is already a frame. It says, let the good times roll. And I really like this one. It's like the perfect quote for 2024. So I want this to be the vision for this year. And I love it. I forgot that I ordered this. It's supposed to be a stand. I don't know if I want that on my wall. But I won't mind having it. Oh, this one's so pretty. Wow, I love this. But this one came with this print. Obviously, I'm not gonna go with this print. I just thought this is cute. Okay, this one 
is in three colors. We have dark brown, a white one, and then we have a black one. Okay, so some time before when I got these prints, I got this from Poppy Prints, by the way. So that time I also ordered two A3 prints, which I did not stick on the wall because I thought they are just too big and I did not want them. Today, I think it's time for them to come out and show themselves. So I ordered one, which is like this. I really like this. But then I also have this one, which is also very pretty. It is like this skeleton with flowers and stuff. It. I'm going to start with the A3 one first, but let's go! most awaited part of this whole transformation which is to turn this wall into a different wall now i am a little okay little is actually like i'm very very nervous for this one everybody every how i know i smile at them and say she told me so everybody every how i know i smile at them and say she told me so everybody every how i know i smile at them and say she told me so everybody every I'm still not done with the wall. I think what I'm about to do will really liven up the wall, make it look three to four times better. Now I'm about to stick this. I wanted a floating shelf. 